Hey guys, as we discussed in the previous video with Shreya, she said she's gonna be here with us for two more videos. This is the second video where she got into Verizon and is gonna explain her uh, interview experience in, for internship plus FT. And the eligibility criteria for this role was uh, eligible branches were CSE and IT and you should have a 70% or 7 CGPA above in both 10th, 12th and as well as your um, bachelor's degree and no standing areas. Should be. Hi Shreya, welcome back. So we've just discussed about, we've made a video on how, she, how Shreya got into Dance IT. Now we are going to discuss about how she got into the second company, which is Verizon. It is also a super dream company in VIT. So yeah, you can tell us about your interview experience, how many rounds were there and everything. So, so a little bit of background information, like uh, uh, I had just finished with the six rounds process of Danscape IT and in the evening when I was chilling, I got a mail that I've been selected for, you know, next uh, round for Verizon. So in the morning itself, I wrote my written test. So I talk about the written test. It was a very easy uh, to moderate level written test, like a few coding questions. Uh, I think I guess two coding questions and uh, aptitude was there. Aptitude was very easy, so if you are uh, practicing little bit of aptitude from any site, any particular site, so I think it should uh, be good. And uh, technical MCQs were there, a few, which were easy. Like overall the written test was easy to moderate level. Okay. And uh, so I got the this mail at 11.30pm around at 9 that I have interview at 11 in the morning. So I was uh, already tired after six rounds, giving six rounds of Danske and I was all prepared for interview. So I just wait, I was just waiting. So at 10.34, I got mail saying that I have been selected for Danske IT. So fast forward to my interview round. So for there were uh, two rounds in Verizon. The first one was uh, technical interview round and the second was HR, normal HR round. So if you clear the first technical round, they will give you a call in the evening for HR round. So in the first technical, the this particular interview was all about my resume. What they like, the interviewer had thoroughly discussed my resume with me, my projects and um, my where I've worked, where I want to, you know, what kind of uh, work I want to do. Mm -hmm. And uh, if I'm comfortable in this language, that language, if I knew, know about, uh, you know, new technologies that, mm -hmm. that, they are, that are uh, currently going on, uh, that are currently booming. Mm -hmm. So he asked me about all these things. So, and a little bit of where is on, like, what do I know about the company? Mm -hmm. If I'm mm -hmm. even aware about the domain they are working in. So all those per types of questions. So one particular uh, question that I remember is to, there was a project, a women's safety Android app project that I made uh, for my type. So in that particular project, he in detail, since it was related to development, app development, it included, I said that I used Android Studio and Java for hmm. it. Hmm. So he asked me a lot of uh, Java questions, uh, like very basic, like, hmm. Hmm. Uh, if you know this, that basic terminologies of Java and all those things, exceptions, how do you accept Inherit. do, yeah, inheritance and how do you do exceptional handling and all those things. So, and he asked me to describe my project thoroughly and what I did and how I did it. So in detail, you have to know your different modules of your project very nicely hmm. and what technology you're using and what component of what component does what hmm. and what was your role in uh, the whole thing and then he asked me about uh, if i know uh, what uh, technologies or uh, new technologies are there going on currently uh, in um, you know uh, web development and so so i talked about mean and mern stack hmm. which hmm. you all must be aware of so i told uh, him about that so he asked me if i'm uh, you know well versed with uh, mean and mern stack so I told him that I'm currently learning about it. It's not like uh, I completely or I completely ace mm -hmm. that, but I know about it and I can learn it. So this was the first technical interview round. Like no life coding, no coding questions, just technical questions and your projects and your resume. So know your resume by heart for this particular round. And in the evening, there was no information in between if I've you know, selected for the <laughs> HR or not. Hmm. So 
in the evening i randomly got a call from a number uh, on my mobile phone hmm. so he said that i am the hr from uh, verizon company and uh, he just took my interview uh, hr interview on then and there on mobile call. phone call so general questions like um, what do you want to do what are your future aspirations and um do you want to go for higher studies how many com- companies you have interviewed with so i obviously did not tell that i have been selected already mm. uh, at one company mm. so i gave it and um, on very few like higher re- regarding higher studies questions regarding higher studies and one was uh, did you like the online infrastructure or the online learning and how was uh, how had your college you know helped mm-hmm. in that So I just told that my college had given us uh, a beautiful, good uh, uh, in online infrastructure to study, so there was no hindrance and all those things. Hmm. Uh, so yeah, that's that's all about my HR interview. Okay, okay, so that's great. So you got uh, selected in uh, both the companies. Then you had the opportunity to choose between both of them. Generally in VIT, we don't get that opportunity because once you get into one super dream, that's it. But you got yeah. the opportunity to choose out of the two. That's great. And so, why did you choose dance, KIT? And yeah, why so did you? So, if you compare the LPI and all, both uh, companies were you know at the same uh, level. There was hardly any difference between LPI. So the most important thing is where you start because it's the start of your career, career. right? So you need to get into a good domain. Yeah. And. Dance K I T is a subsidiary of Dance K Bank, which is again a banking domain, and uh, Verizon was telecommunications and service related kind of thing. So I selected Dan- Dance K because of basically because of domain. It's banking domain and it's booming right now. Hmm. So it will give me a good uh, start to my career. And uh, other than that, um, I was told by my seniors that there's a good work-life balance in hmm. Dance K. Okay. Uh, I I don't know about Verizon, the hmm. work-life balance there, but main thing was uh, because it's a uh, financial domain. Took, uh, yeah, and because they took ex- very extensive six rounds, hmm. uh, so basically I'll get a good opportunity there. So that's yeah. why. Okay. So I would also like to congratulate you once again. You, I know you were sick that day. You're not feeling well, and still you give the interviews of both the companies, and then got into both, uh, both, both of them. So that's really great. Yeah, I think we uh, wait, waiting for a long time to get in, yeah. to get to uh, you know interview in companies, and then all together I got two companies together at the same time, and I was also sick and had yeah. fever as well. But I think it all paid off at the end. Yeah. Just. and your turn will come, come. yeah so thank you again for joining and thanks everybody for watching we have shreya again for the next video she also got into cognizant so she'll share that experience also with us so yes. yeah keep watching thank you thank you